What up, guys? Katie from the Grass Skirt Lounge. So, I got some Gorilla Biscuit, which is an indica, and I have Lemon Drop, which is a hybrid. Um, I'm not sure whether it's sativa or indica dominant, but right now what I have loaded up in the corn cob pipe is Gorilla Biscuit. I'm going to just let you guys know. Like, I'm not going to bother showing you guys the buds. In fact, I'll show you the size of the buds. Fuck it. But I'm going to let you guys know right now the lemon biscuit, you ever get a chance to hop on some lemon biscuit, which you probably won't because this dispensary and my man hooked me up. You know what I'm saying? He subscribed to the Grass Skirt Lounge on YouTube. So that's what's up. Follow me. You watch this video, fam. Follow me on um on Instagram too, man. I'm sorry, not Instagram, but man, this shit smells fucking delicious. I love the way this lemon drop smells. It smells beautiful. I can't wait to hit this shit either, man. But um, follow me on uh, uh on Twitter, man. And um, yeah, man, and, and just keep and just keep following along, man, cause it, shit is about to take off. The delivery business is like it's coming a lot sooner than I than expected. Um, so yeah, man, it, everything is looking good. But I'm gonna go ahead and do my bud review on the Gorilla Biscuit first. Know what I mean, so I don't need the life for that. Know what I mean, listening to the radio. Wait, hold up, I do need the light to find my lighter. Bam, that is chilling in the whip. Listening to the radio. I, I very rarely listen to the radio. It's just that I can't listen to the radio or rather play the soundtrack from my phone while I'm using my phone to record. So, that is what it is. Now, both those buds were very dense. They weren't light, fluffy buds. They were pretty dense, you know, pretty, pretty compact. So, you know... Be smoking on those for a little while. Might actually last me a week. And just so you know what type of hookup I got. These were two more than more than ten dollar a, a, a gram uh, uh, buds. And I got the hookup. Like I said, I got both of these with twenty when it should have cost me more. Good looking out to the homie again. I mean, but right now, so far as the Gorilla Biscuit is concerned, man, the Gorilla Biscuit is smoking very well. Um, <coughs> <coughs> there's definitely some gag factor here, <coughs> as you guys can hear. And in case you guys haven't noticed, I am listening to some old school shit. It's some old school TLC shit, man. Back from like, from the 90s, like 94, 95. You know what I'm saying? Maybe even 93 for real. Maybe not that early. But this is what we were listening to when I was a kid. You know what I'm saying? TLC and shit like that. And Vogue was out. This shit is considered an oldie now, man. Like that shit is crazy to think music from the 90s is considered oldies now. This shit just bugs me out. I mean, I know I'm getting old, but that shit is just funny to me, man. And the funny part is, a lot of the music from today still is trash compared to some of the music from the 90s. I'm just saying, 70s, some of the music from the 80s, too. I understand. Don't take offense to that. It's just a, uh, an objective observation. But yeah, man. This Gorilla Biscuit is smoking pretty well. Um, the taste is very uh, very subtle. It's not very pungent. It doesn't have a real strong aroma either. But the taste is very subtle, man. It's, um, it's uh, oh, my bad. I'm covering up the uh, camera and shit. But it, this is some, it's some good shit, man. It's, it's real good. It's real subtle. It's not real strong and overpowering, you know. And uh, I forgot what this was. An indica. This is an indica, so probably going to sleep pretty good tonight. You know, and I didn't put a whole lot of grass in either. So this bud definitely burns slow too. And I am going to, I am going to look into those hemp wraps too, man. Those, um, those hemp leaf wraps. Because I, I want to experiment. I want to get back. I miss smoking blunts. I'm not going to stunt. I stopped smoking blunts because of the tobacco. Because I gave up on all tobacco products. But I want to get back into the swing of things with the blunts, man. But it's got to be something that's all natural, you know. So... 
I'm going to look into that. Probably next week, I'll probably grab some um some hemp papers. And that way, I can get some new grass and tell you guys how it smokes out of the hemp papers too, man. So, yeah, that'll, that'll definitely do it. And probably promote that brand if I like it. You know what I'm saying? But let me reload this joint with the, uh, the lemon drop so we can get that one in. And, yes, you guys did hear me say that I did want to start smoking blunts again. And... Again, it has to be something all natural. I stop, and I yes, I do smoke marijuana, and I don't smoke tobacco products. Yeah, and it's all about health concerns and all that. Anybody that doubts me, which none of you who probably are watching this video doubts this, cigarettes are way more dangerous than marijuana. Bro, I can run. I can go run two and a half, three miles, you feel me, and be good at, you know what I'm saying, smoking grass, you know what I'm saying, and be good. My... I find that marijuana doesn't take away from, excuse me, my cardiovascular health at all. That's me. You know what I'm saying? I stay active. I run. You know what I'm saying? I do different types of cardio. I work out. So I stay I stay pretty active, you know, keep myself pretty active. And I drink tons of water. Also, I pretty much only drink water anyway. But I'm about to hit the uh, lemon drop. Tastes great too, man. Man, this shit tastes great. It's very aromatic. It has a real great taste. And like I said, it actually smells like lemon. Mm. It has a pretty good aftertaste too. And again, it's not overpowering, you know? Like you notice the lemon smell when you open up the cap and take that whiff. You notice the lemon smell. It 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 it, it is definitely pro it's very pronounced, but it's not overpowering, you know. Some good shit. And I am feeling that Gorilla Biscuit right now, too. Coupled with this hybrid, I should have a pretty good high after this. But I would really love to smoke some of this lemon drop out of a fucking hemp blunt, hemp wrap uh, paper. Or hemp wrap. Sorry about that. Man, that, that that actually sounds like a really good idea. What do you guys what do you have any of you guys out there had any fucking um any hint wrapping papers, any um hint leaves? I would love to know what you guys fuck know what you guys think about uh about those. I have yet to try them. Yeah, yeah. This, this this lemon drop tastes good, man. Yes, I am breaking in the new whip, christening it with um with this review. I don't think I've actually now I've smoked in this, but I don't think I've actually done a video in the, in the new whip yet. But um, I'm doing one now. You guys can't even tell, but got the pipe um pointed up at the sunroof. I mean, but yeah, yo. This shit is good. And again, I can't say this enough. The delivery business look like it's coming off. Like it's going to come off without a hitch. Now, I'm not saying that it's easy, but things are looking good. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? One conversation with two of my homies. You know what I mean? Con connections that were made there, they're hard to fucking get. Especially when you're just jumping out there into the shit. But it's definitely coming, man. And holler at us on Twitter. Facebook, YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Hit us up. Um, I'm going to get the Instagram thing jumping off. But I really want to have more time to really manage all all four. I mean, it's, you know, with, with everything else that I'm trying to do, it's kind of hard to manage, you know, all everything I'm trying to do, trying to get the business started and managing four um, social media accounts, you know. Not that the traffic is real heavy so far, but I can only imagine, you know what I'm saying, once it starts to pick up, how much more time consuming all of that would be. But I'll do I'll do the IG once, especially when I start pumping out more material. You guys got to understand, I, I work too, you know what I'm saying, and I have other interests, other things that I have to, that I'm dedicated to, so I may... I may take little drops off here and there, you know what I'm saying? But 
all of that's going to change. I'm telling you, all that's going to change because I really want to promote this brand. I really want to get it out there. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Hooked up with a, um with another cool brother tonight, you know. Hopefully, we got some interviews coming. You know what I'm saying? And especially for all my newbies to the game. You know, all my people who live in non-legal states or potentially legal states. You know, we are... <clears throat> I'm going to keep putting information out there for you guys so you guys can stay hip to what's going on, you know. Uh, and I, I'm telling y'all, man, I'm going to get these interviews done for everybody that I met down at the Leafly ses Bud, Bud Tender Session, down in L.A. at the town hall meeting. Look, all of that is coming, man. That's going to come. You know what I'm saying? I, I love for it to happen immediately, but, you know, time things just don't work that way. But... Trust and believe it's coming. I'm talking like a motherfucker. Let me keep smoking. Yeah, so two more strains I recommend. Gorilla Biscuit and Lemon Drop. Definitely Lemon Drop. If you can find Lemon Drop, buy that shit. <clears throat> Real talk. Buy that shit. It's 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 good shit. It's, it, it is definitely some good shit. The taste, the smell, everything about it, man. Smoking it out of a blunt will probably be fucking magical. I'm just saying. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, end this video because I'm high as shit from a little bit earlier, too. And that's not fun. I did smoke earlier. But now I'm starting to get there with the new shit I just blazed. But again, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, holla at us, hit us up, comment, subscribe, like, share, all that good shit, you know, you know, add your input, <clears throat> you know, if any of these strains you guys have uh, had the pleasure of blazing up, let me know what you thought about it, you know, your first immediate reaction to it, so on and so forth, and yeah, man, I'm out, peace, and this is a classic song, by the way. Lauren Hill, the Fugees. Can y'all hear that? Yeah. Uh, uh, definitely, Miss Hill was ahead of her time, without a doubt, man. Ahead of her time. Genius. But anyway, I'm out, guys. Katie from the Grass Skirt Lounge. Twitter, Facebook, YouTube. Holla at us. Peace.